you know, there's a lot that I don't know, to be quite honest. And uh, this car showed me that real quick. Obviously, you guys know that I'm a car enthusiast, or I'd like to think so. Um, but there's a lot of things that I really overlooked. For example, just like the basics of a car engine and how it works, like there's a lot of things that I don't know. Yes, I know what an air filter does, I know what an oil filter does, I know what an intake is, but there's a lot of other shit that I completely overlooked and it's things that I should know. It's just general knowledge and I don't have that yet. And so with that being said, I kind of just wanted to throw like a little disclaimer out there. I'm not like some car guru, I'm not like a mechanic god or anything, like I'm just as green as you probably are watching this video. I'm just really eager to learn about it, but I feel like I picked a really hard platform to start learning on. Sabrina's got a couple issues that I found out yesterday. Oh, by the way, I'm on the road now. So she's got a couple issues that I found out yesterday. Uh, number one, I definitely need some new brake pads and rotors in the back. Um, I do have some in my cart. I'm gonna go ahead and order those either today or tomorrow. Um, as far as the fender over there, I actually just ordered that this morning, so it should be coming in maybe next week, week after. Uh, coilovers I did also order I think the other day so they should yeah, excuse me so those should be shipping out probably next week so stay tuned for that you guys probably can't see under there but I do actually have a gas leak from my gas tank um, I'm actually going to get that checked out today and also uh, my AC doesn't work um, probably just needs to be recharged but I'm not a hundred percent so fingers crossed that's what it is uh, motor runs pretty good. I did, I did a couple pulls yesterday just to kind of get the feel of it. I'm sorry I didn't record it for you guys. The only issue that I noticed right off rip when I uh, took it out the driveway was it started to smoke over here in the turbo slash up pipe area. It was kind of inconsistent, really, really wispy, like to the point where you could barely even see it. And so I drove it a few more times and it was only when I hit boost and after I let it sit there and idle for a minute. It doesn't do it anymore, which led me to believe that maybe there was just some stuff from it sitting there for a while in my driveway. It sat for about two weeks, so I probably just have to go ahead and evaporate. Yeah, so these three spots are literally just from yesterday, from my gas tank. So that's when I first noticed it. This is when I moved it and I realized, like, mm, there's a spot over there that's not uh, oil or anything. That's weird. And then this is from the third time I actually just moved it because I had to go somewhere. And so now it's parked in the grass solely for that reason. I'm tired of standing up my dad's driveway. <laughs> By the way, if it wasn't already kind of apparent, there is gonna be a little bit of a change in style of video. I know before I was doing mainly car reviews and things like that back when I was working at the dealership. Currently, I don't work there right now because of this whole coronavirus thing, and I actually don't live in Vermont anymore. Yeah, so you'll be seeing more of like the installs, car meets, just more vlog, a little bit lengthier videos. So let me know what you guys think. Hopefully you enjoy them. I know I enjoy making them, so. What'd you get? Use this? Oh. What the hell is in the grass? It's not rally car. I think I'll take the Beamer instead of the Acura. No, you can take the Acura back there. It's fine. It's already for you. H22 CL for you, dude. It's all you. It just needs a little bit of tender love and care. That's all. No, it just needs a wash. Tender That's love and job. care. <laughs> well, you don't just get it in gold. I know. <laughs> I need new brakes so bad. You know, I just made a, I just made a really dumb rookie mistake looking for this place. It's literally across the street, dude. Oh my god. It is definitely hot outside. I don't know why I wore flannel. It looked like it was gonna rain today, but it's still really, really humid. Now you guys can see the whole Ooh. ass tank needs to get changed. Big Ooh. ass tank, see? <laughs> it's huge, I know. Oh my god. That's a thumbnail right there. For like any leaks up by the turbo or anything. Wow, that's really hot. My finger just touched it. Ow. But no. It looks dry up there. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. It does sound pretty cool. 
Woo! That scared the shit out of me. I thought we just did something bad. Oh my god. I thought I was about to get in trouble. Woo! So I actually ended up just having to, uh, I ended up actually just having to get a new gas tank, which is fine, no big deal. It's only like 200 bucks. It wasn't too, too bad. And like I said, the car feels really, really good. It rides really smooth. Um, it's just that gas tank that was kind of an issue. Like, I'll get on it right now for you guys. You know, driving a manual and recording is really, really hard. I don't know if you guys can tell. So I'm gonna put this camera down until I get some more stationary. Really sorry if that last clip was kind of like trash, but like I said, it's really hard to drive straight and record at the same time. So deal with it. Alright. So this is a new flavor of monster. I never had this before, but we're gonna crack a good old FTB for the boys. Right, Junior? <laughs> so apparently they're doing a lot of work on your road, huh? That clean ass road! <laughs> for the boys. It tastes pretty good. It tastes like, like, like mangoes and, and pineapples and citrus. Shit. It's pretty good. It, it sounds pretty good. It sounds decent, but it's still gonna be louder eventually. True. You know, if I wasn't afraid of like breaking my diff and my axles and everything right now because I have such an old car, I would definitely probably be doing the same. You smell that? That's not your tires, buddy. <laughs> so these ones you just push down. Right over there, there, and there. And then this one I think you just have to pry up. And then there's also a couple bolts I think down here somewhere. And then you can just pull the whole bumper off. Honestly, this isn't my car, so I don't know. That's actually easier than I thought. One more right here. Yeah. Two. So if I just pull it up though, it's just... Uh, I don't know. Oh, look oh, at that. Oh, so there's that one right there. Where's the chicken bird? Rich gang. I'm just gonna put this on top of my phone. I've taken this car apart so many times. Time. Yeah, at this point, it must be just super easy for you, huh? Yeah, it is. It really is. Is that the last bolt, or is there more? No, that's the last one. All right, so we can just take it right off now. Oh, headlight! I forgot. Oh fuck! Come on. I, when I told you it fell off, I mean it fell off. Yeah, that fell off completely. That's not. There's not supposed to be that much play. I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be a bracket or something to hold this in. Isn't yeah, there? look, it's busted. Yeah. So if you guys look on this side, right? I don't know if you guys can see the bracket on this side. Versus over here, yeah, where it's it's, it's non-existent. This is supposed to be up here. This actually cracked because this driveway you guys can't see right now, but like it's really not the best for low cars. So every time he comes in, he scrapes, and this cracked one day. He had some zip ties holding it, and those also just cracked a few minutes ago. They're all fucking. Oh, yep, they're man, I threw them. well, they were they're on the ground over there somewhere. Just like that, like like you're trying to close it. Boom, sorry, the camera fell, guys, but that's all we were doing, literally, okay. just threading it through. Yeah. Are we doing another one, or is that it? Oh, I'm doing a shit ton of them. Okay, it's a boy. Get that through there. So there you go. Now you can Frankenstein your bumper. Just cut these, and you should be all set. Not too, too hard. It's almost perfect. You can see it just a little bit. You kind of stare at it, but good job, buddy. Bro, I think you need new coil packs. No, the fuck I don't. The <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, no, I, I'm just those kidding. Those are actually like not even a year old. Oh. Ooh. Oh, I guess that's useless now. You know, since I'm doing this, I should really disconnect the battery. So yeah. I can electrocute the shit out of myself. Yeah, so what fuse is this for again? It's for your, your system if you run a, if you run a speaker or whatever, a subwoofer. Oh, so like if I just if I ever decide I want to get like a bigger speaker yeah you or need something? you need to run this okay if you want a subwoofer you have to run this all right good to know unless you want to kill your car or something <laughs> I don't no. think even I don't think it would even work without it no what's up he exploded the <gasps> fuck out of it the other end is in there so just so you guys are aware this is completely blown obviously you can look at it and see that it's destroyed it's supposed to look like that. 
yeah, no bueno. Well, that was easy. Yeah, it's just where I located it. It's a pain in the fucking ass. Awesome! Here you go. All if done. it blows up, I'm gonna be fucking pissed. <laughs> Boy, that was a 50 amp one. Or 50, yeah, whatever. 50 watt little fuse. I Thanks, Junior. That. I appreciate it. Dude, I rocked that at my very first talk show. <laughs> you button everything back up. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, putting these clips back on was kind of frustrating, but we did it. Actually, the only thing I made a mistake on was putting this on, so it's supposed to kind of slide under the bumper right here, like this little indentation here, but I didn't realize that, but I fixed it, and we're good now. Maybe you're asking yourself, wow, Jacob, why aren't you doing any work on your own car? Because I don't have my parts yet. I ordered everything, but it should be here, like, I think maybe next week or the week after, so stay tuned. So I know today's video was kind of like, weird miscellaneous and probably very different from what I normally do and as I said at the beginning there's gonna be a lot of that but uh, I hope you guys did like it if you did then comment like and subscribe you know the deal and um, hopefully I'll have another video out for you guys like the next week week or so so stay tuned peace out guys Junior thank you for the adapter now I can listen to music again at least since I get rid of this bunk ass radio Ha <laughs> ha